Welcome to another episode of Dan Frequently Asked Questions. In this episode, we're going to be talking about mask squeeze and the potential of COVID being a cause of it. Keep watching. We got a question from a diver diving in Fiji that suffered significant facial squeeze or face squeeze as a result of diving. Now here is the interesting aspect of facial squeeze with a face mask. It is usually people who don't struggle to equalize their ears that tend to get problems with a face mask. The reason is they can sometimes just open their eustachian tubes voluntarily and then don't exhale into the mask as someone that does the Valsalva maneuver typically would. And so paradoxically and ironically, people who equalize easily sometimes neglect equalizing their mask. Now there are some things you can do to help minimize the chances of getting squeeze in the mask. One of those is a low volume mask because obviously the smaller the volume that is going to be compressed as a result of Boyle's law, the less the effect of that pressure is going to be. The second thing is to deliberately exhale into the mask and also not to tighten the straps down too much so that you can in fact exhale into the mask and relax the mask on your face. Even though it sounds like that would increase its volume a little, a tight strap on the mask can actually already cause a bit of a squeeze which you don't want to do. As far as COVID is concerned, Clearly, if you have COVID, COVID symptoms and or are suspicious of having COVID or even a head cold and flu that are affecting your upper respiratory tract, remember it's never a good idea to go diving then. Not only are you potentially putting other people at risk as a result of the infection, but remember that equalizing issues are also a warning sign of the lungs. In other words, if there is mucus in the eustachian tubes, then there is likely to be excess mucus in the lungs. And an injury to the lungs can be fatal as opposed to just inconvenient or possibly causing barotrauma of the sinuses or middle ear. So it's very, very important not to dive with a head cold, difficulty equalizing, difficulty with uh, just maintaining pressure or having reverse blocks. All of these are warning signs that there is not normal passage of air through the respiratory passages which include the eustachian tubes and the tubes that go to the sinuses. I hope that gives you some information. So until next time, safe diving.